case is about the Smith VL versus the London and the South Western Railway Company. Negligence requires duty to insured. Now we are going to see the facts of this case. First is the workmen employed by the defendant railway company to cut the grass and the trim the hedge bordering the railway line. Means here a workman is employed who has given the work by the company to cut the grass and trim the hedge which are bordering the railway line. The servant left the trims and the cutting in hips between the line and hitch hitch for the fortnight means two months 14 days he has left that trims between the line means of the railway line then the fire passing from the engine ignited one of these hips and burned the hitch and spread over the neighboring field from there a high wind carried the fire across a road to the plaintiff's cottage situated two, 200 yards from the spot where the fire begin and the cottage was burned down means from the railway station up till to 200 yards the fire was spread and that led to the burning of the cottage of the plaintiff so the question to be decided by the court was whether the burning of the cottage was or not a remote consequence arising out of the negligent act of the defendants railway company company servant means here the question was asked that who is liable whether the company or that servant so it was argued on the behalf of the defendant that a no reasonable man could have foreseen the consequences the court nevertheless held that as the burning of the cottage was a direct consequences of the act of the defendant so defendant was liable means that company was liable